peace and blessings y'all how you doing this is your boy Gerald it is 31 degrees <laughs> it's cold out here how is each and every one of you doing um, I felt compelled to put this out right now because I got a feeling that somebody needs some validation on how they feeling and you all confused because you're looking at the calendar and you're trying to bounce your time with your priorities and then on top of that you know the weekend is coming up for Valentine oh, for Valentine's Day <laughs> and um, I wanted to put this out real quick see you're gonna be racking your brain looking for the perfect gift the perfect card the perfect symbolism on what this day exemplifies, right? Let me explain something to you. And I hope you hear this loud and clear. Because see, I see your worth. You know I do. The greatest gift you're going to ever give to someone, it starts with yourself. But if you go a little deeper, if you want to give a gift that lasts a lifetime, it's called transparency. That's right. See, you can't find that in a store. And even if you could find it in a store, the price tag for your, trans your transparency, there's no amount of money that could match it. Because see, there's only one you. That's right. One you. There are 7.5 billion people on this planet. And we all share commonalities of life. We all go through peaks and valleys. But guess what? One thing is constant. Your higher power is I know him as my Lord Jesus Christ. But I'm humbled to know he is one of many names. He loves you. Because it's unconditional. So I know some of y'all are saying, well, you know what, Gerald? You let him come in that door without that box, without that card, without that sparkling thing on that day. I'm going to be messed up. But ask yourself this. Valentine's Day is one day. What about the other 364? There should be a consistency that earns the right for that person to be in your life. Remember, you know how I always put this out in my videos? If they haven't earned the right to invest in your time, they don't earn the right to walk with you. And if they're not willing to walk with you, how can you call them friend? Because see, to be able to have that title that is truly sacred. See, there are going to be many of people that are going to come. They're going to audition for that position. And unfortunately, they're going to fall short because, see, until you make a conscious decision to love yourself, because it all starts from within you, until you make that conscious decision to see your worth, to see your value, you can't speak your truth. And if you can't speak your truth, then your environment is not speaking back. Because see, all they do is validate your state of mind. That's why it's very important that each and every one of you love yourself. See, that's the trade-off. See, a lot of times we try to convince ourselves that if I just use the... How can I say this? Use the things to suspend time. I, I can figure out all the rest. And, I'm, and guess what happens? You end up becoming disappointed. You end up seeing something that may have no long, may have not been real to begin with. But guess what? Even with disappointment, there's a blessing on the other side. So you got to understand something, y'all. 
there are some people that you're not even supposed to fellowship with. And it's not being mean. It's not being selfish. It's being selfless because, see, you deserve to be happy. I know I'm talking to somebody. It shouldn't feel like the, the, the connection is forced through negativity. Well, oh, you know, if I don't argue with him this week, he don't love me. Well, if he's in your life and you don't feel the connection is like breathing, why is he there? Or, well, if I don't do what is required, she going to leave you. Well, let her leave because she don't deserve to be with you anyway. You're not supposed to settle. You're not supposed to take an L. You're not supposed to concede when it comes to your happiness. We're talking the greatest gift you could ever give somebody. That's your time, y'all. That's your time. So when you out in the highways and byways, be safe. But think of this. Are they worth the moment that you are giving right now? Some of your greatest accolades you can give to a person is not seen. It is felt. But if you don't know who you are, how can you understand where you're going? So don't get caught up on trying to keep up with the Joneses. See, because the Joneses, they worry about what's going on, the superficial, not what's going on inside. They, they, they don't want to touch that because that requires them to be honest. They don't want to show that because they understand that if you see that side of them, you're going to see a side that is fragile. And that's okay. That's okay. So don't rack your brain. Don't disappoint yourself by trying to live up to something that ain't you. Because trust and believe. You know that, <laughs> you know God, he is a custom tailored God. He will give you what you need when you need it. That's why you, we learn through disappointment because you come to understand what is a need compared to what is a want. You got to see your worth, y'all. Got, you got to see your worth. I know somebody's saying right now, well, you know, girl, I, I, I provide. You know, I, 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 you know, I keep them lights on. I, I'm there. You know, well, you know, that's part of it. That's part of a commitment. But guess what? Maybe the greatest gift that you can give at this time is speaking from within. That's what courage is. Speak your truth. And I guarantee you, the more and more that you go inside, you connect with your higher power, you will come to understand what joy is compared to temporary fulfillment. You guys are worth it, y'all. <laughs> All right, guys. Guys, praying for you. You know I am. I see your work. You know I got to. It's 31 degrees when we got a we got a wind chill. My uh, it's, it feels like every bit of about 10. But I love each and every one of y'all. And if you got any questions or concerns, by all means, hit me up. Worst thing can come out of it is advice and a prayer. You're worth it, y'all. Stay blessed. Bye.